Los Angeles. Welcome Earl David Reed. Here is Earl David Reed. Please welcome country comedian, trendsetter Earl David Reed. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. I'm just surprised to see all of you as you are to see one of me. Yes. <laughs> this world's getting really strange. You know, I get on the elevator, just me and this woman. We're ethnically different. She feels really intimidated. As Soon as the door shuts, we're in the same elevator. As soon as the door shuts, she looks over at me, really stupid, starts wrapping her purse around her arm. And I'm thinking, how stupid is this? I mean, even if I were the kind of person that wanted to steal her purse, where the hell am I going? I'm in the elevator. <laughs> but he goes, give me that. Could you push four, please? <laughs> I love Nashville, boy, because I love that Southern accent. If I can meet a woman with a Southern accent, I'd marry her in a second, boy. Woo. But yeah, you got to be careful, though, because if you don't pay attention, you can look like an idiot when they talk to you. I was in a restaurant. All I wanted was a potato. The waiter didn't say, how would you like the potato? He just yells at me how I could have it. So I go, I like a potato. He goes, masturbate. <laughs> now, what he was saying was mash or baked. I know that today. <laughs> <laughs> About two weeks ago, I thought he was yelling something else at me that I thought was a little bit too drastic for a potato. <laughs> like, you, I want a potato. You go, Master Bank. Finally, I snap. I go, for a potato? I said, skip that. Give me the rice. <laughs> Guy next to me is eating a potato. I go, I know what you did with that. <laughs> Shame on you. Give it up for Harrisburg's own funny man, Mr. Earl.